Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel, the MK Lady. Well, today is Unboxing Friday. Now, I know I said I was going to switch them to Thursday. I'm still getting used to my schedule and trying to upload all days of the week except for the weekend, so Monday to Friday, but sometimes it doesn't work out that way and I get super busy and trying to go back to the office and then do videos and yeah it's a lot so we're just going with what I can do for now and so Friday is today the unboxing I should tell you about the outfit of the day we do have an unboxing but it's not a coach it's actually a Louis Vuitton I'm finally finally getting to unbox this one I want to do it before summer's over so I should quickly tell you about my outfit of the day so this blazer I got last year from Reitman's. This kind of off the shoulder peplum top I got from Ricky's last year. It's, it's a little bit big. And then of course my standard black leggings. The Michael Kors watch is the beautiful white MK watch. I do have my Fitbit and my rutilated quartz and my other bracelet. And then these are the new Hilbergenberg vanilla ice mocha or something. They're the new ones, the fall ones there. So that's what I have on for my outfit of the day. Now, I want to explain this purse for a minute because it is an oldie and I got it at Oliver Jewelry. Now remember I got the little key pouch from Oliver Jewelry. Their shipping is so so fast and I cannot believe how fast they are. They are based out of Toronto, Ontario and so when I seen this on the website and Joe Jurit Jurgis is the manager. He had sent me the um, his card there, so a shout out to him. And I've been looking for something in Damier Azure for quite a while. And when this popped on the site, because you can rarely find them, so this one is quite old. But I'll explain that in a minute. And I'm just getting a text message. So. This one, they didn't have a dust bag, so that always explains the coach or other dust bags. This one is the certificate of authenticity for, it is 2007, so 14, so what, 21 years old, I believe. I think that's it. I am no good at math. Oh my goodness. So it's 2021. I'm just using my little calculator here. Minus 2007. I don't want to No, 14 years old. What am I saying? 21 years old. It's 14 years old, but it is a looker. Now, let me tell you. So it did come with this and I paid. Let's see. So it was regular $11.95, but then I had 20% off or something like that. And you only pay GST and it ended up being for $9.56 and the total was $1,003 for a 14 year old bag. And it also did come, oh, here's the guarantee authentic card. It did come with the little lock and key. And look at that tarnish. Now, because it's 14 years old, you have to know that, that it is going to be a little bit tarnished. But I do have a solution for those. And I just dropped something here. So, sorry, something I want to show you after I do the unboxing. So, I want to show you a little trick that I think I know. I've been watching other YouTube videos. Let's get right into this. So this one is the Speedy B25 in the Damier Abin print. Now that's why I'm wearing my outfit because it's still a little bit summery. But here it is right here. Now I know that the handles will be a little patinaed because you know with people's oil and 
their body and touching um, it is not actually that bad so and the canvas looks really good um, even the piping looks good there's no stains you could still see the Louis Vuitton on there I mean there's a few little minor scratches on the tabs here but nothing to speak about and also there is still gold on the hardware and it is a beautiful beautiful purse now this is the smallest and it's a classic and it's a speedy b and now i want the lv monogram but these are always sold out like if you buy them new and then I heard that they changed the type of canvas they use and nowadays the newer ones aren't as thick so I already use this for summer and I know I've heard a lot of people saying that they wish they would have got the bandolier and I kind of wish I would have got the bandolier <laughs> but I mean I didn't mind carrying it I'll give you a little bit of a mod shot so I didn't mind carrying it just on the crook of my arm just like that and then hand holding it but it would have been nice to have like a strap and I don't even have maybe I'll order one from Amazon or something get a strap like that now I'm going to show you the inside and on the inside is a bag insert there's one slip pocket back here I mean you, whoops oh iPhone 12 just about crack it you could stick your iPhone 12 mini not a plus in there but then that is why you have the insert now I ordered this insert on Amazon and it doesn't quite fit as well as I would like it to fit because you could see these are pointing in but I mean that's okay um, I don't carry a whole lot so let's just grab say my makeup case here we'll just zip it up we'll stick a makeup case I didn't want to do a what's in my bag but I'm doing it anyway and then my wallet so stick that and a mask and I mean there's still room let's see put this mask right here there's still room for other items if I wanted to stick something else in there but I mean, it's still a cute little bag. It is the size, I, you've seen like a million reviews on these, but I did want to show you. Let me tell you, um, when you're taking the measurements for the inside, some people say this closing is a little bit too small, but I don't mind it. I would rather have this one than the, um, the bigger ones I guess you could say so I'm gonna take out this kind of felt thing here because I wanted to show you something so let's see so you kind of have to squish it in there so this is what the felt thing looks like and I believe it was $35 on Amazon and you could put this insert in there but when you do have it in the speedy b you can't put the insert in so that's why i have it out so i took it out and then so it kind of squishes at the sides and that's what you're seeing and for me i like to have the insert to give it structure because then it kind of like folds in and i'm just looking over here because i do have another insert that i ordered I ordered this insert as well for my Palace BB that I didn't do the unboxing for yet either. So that is the unboxing for Friday. I'm so excited and we'll go ahead and put that here. So let's start looking at the lock and we'll put the felt thing there. So this lock is a bit tarnished. I ordered these jewelry cleaners wipes from Amazon as well. I've been ordering quite a bit of Amazon lately and it said to use, okay, well that one has stuff on it, to use a 
I've been cleaning my jewelry with them. I think it was like a hundred for ten dollars or something. So let's take a look at this actually works. So there is the LV and yeah, it's not really a little bit is coming off there. But not totally. Maybe I have to get some different type of polish or work on it. Let's see, on the back, is it coming off there? Hmm. Okay, so this is not the greatest. But maybe I can order, um, you know, some other kind of cleaning cloths. It doesn't look like it's really coming off on the cloth as well. So... Yeah, scrap that idea. <laughs> but I use these for cleaning my jewelry. And yeah, no, it's not really cleaning. It's actually, I think it's taking some of the, the coating off. So let's not do that anymore. But this actually lock, and I don't, I don't think I'm going to use it. That's why I have it packed away. So you can lock it here. Lock your purse up. I never ever had to lock my purse up, but maybe someday I'll have to. And then you can take the key and lock it like that. So that's the Louis Vuitton Speedy B. I might look at getting the other one, the LV print. I'm not sure. So I do have a few other things I need to show you before we end this video. And while I was at Winners, yes. Angela always goes to winners. Um, I did find this. I had to, what did I have to do? I had to, I looked at this is a Bally's Total Fitness Step On Technology Body Analysis Scale. So it gives you your body mass, your muscle mass, hydration, body fat, BMI, and your calorie intake. So I figured it out this morning and I think I got it and it was for $29 so I wanted to take a look at that and then I've been wanting some little kind of socks that don't you know they're the sneaker socks so I found these Keds six pair sneaker socks $9.99 you know you gotta grab things when you see them otherwise they'll disappear from winners and then because the evenings are getting cooler, I did pick up this Puma zip up hoodie. Now this one was for $34.99 and it's a bit thicker. So I wanted to show you that, but then you know how I've been getting into my crystals lately and everything. I decided to stop at Michael's and they're having 40% off some this this company is the semi precious beads uh bead landing company 40 percent off so i'm gonna make my own bracelets and i ordered some on amazon but they got stuck in shipping so this one is the rose quartz amethyst and aquamarine so i'm gonna try and make my own and then this one is the black network type of stone so i'm gonna try make my own and 40 percent off that really beats because i think like i think these end up being five bucks but this one i bought in the mall here the rutilated quartz one and it was like 21 dollars. so if i can make my own and look at the positive crystal energy i think i'm going to try make my own we'll see what that works out too and then there's just two more things so going back to the speedy b now i've been reading and watching a lot of cleaners and trying to clean or condition these i'm going to try that with this big four and a lot of people say that it's a good cleaner and then i do have to buy some protector for that so i'm going to try and it conditions cleans polishes protects amazon i think it was 34 dollars, so i'm going to try that i did try it on my palace bb to you know mo moisturize the leather on that and it seemed to work so we'll give it a try on that i hope it doesn't patina any darker 
And then Sephora was having a sale that if you spend $50, you can get 20% off your next order. So, you know, I always get this luminous set. I just love, love this luminous set. So you get the eye cream, the moisturizer, and then the Brighton. It has taken away some of my age spots and brown spots. And so 50, this was $56. So the next order I'm gonna be put in, putting in is Drunk Elephant. And because it's my birthday month, you always get a little my, uh, birthday surprise with it. So I picked out this NARS Laguna lipstick and bronzer. I'm going to give that a try. And then, of course, you always get your samples. And then I really wanted to try this. This It's Gloss Balm Cream. So I really wanted to try this and see what it looks like by uh, Fenty Beauty by Rihanna. So we'll do, whoa, look at how much that is. I didn't totally expect that. I'm actually just gonna put some on right now and see what that's like. Okay, it's pretty thick. <laughs> so let's just take a look. Uh, yeah, it's not a bad color. See, it's right there. Now do I have a Kleenex? So, that one, um, I'll give it a try and see how that works. It's pretty moisturizing and it feels really good. So I do like it wet my fingers off before. I think that is everything I have for you today. There was an unboxing, there was Sephora, there was Winners, and these Amazon kind of uh, bag shapers. Love, love, love those. And the 14 year old Louis Vuitton Speedy B, so, so pretty. I need to put the organizer back in because you could see that it's concaving in. And that's all I have for you today. So thank you for watching. Please subscribe to my channel, The MK Lady. Also, don't forget to hit the notification bell because every time I upload a video, you will get notified. Have a great day. Bye.